Today, um, we are celebrating Mother's Day, so I have a very special guest. It's my mom. Hi, everyone. <laughs> and she's going to share some of her beauty tips that I've given her and that she does. And so um, I hope you guys enjoy. So hit it, Mom. One of the things that I've used as I've gotten a little older is Oil A uh, uh, Regenerating Serum. And um, I have a little bit of problems with fine lines around my eyes and around the corners of my lips and even underneath uh, my chin. And I will put this on before I put my makeup on and it kind of smooths everything out and firms everything. Um, it's kind of a little mini facelift. Yeah. So that's one of the things that I particularly like. And I know that some of you have talked to me about wanting some good anti-aging stuff, and she swears by the stuff. You've been using it for how long? Uh, a lot of years. Yeah. So um, this is by Olay, and you can normally find really good sales on this. So definitely keep this. This is the Olay Regenerous um, Serum. Okay. Another item, this is something that Ashley had shared with me, and it is for your eyebrows. And um, it is... This is the Brow Zings by Benefit. This is in the shade medium. I actually got this for her a couple weeks ago. And as you can see, it's the one with the two powders. What do you like about it? Um, one of the things that I like is when I used a pencil before, as I've gotten a little older, my, I have some sparse places in my eyebrows and um, an occasional gray hair here or there. <laughs> and so um, one of the things that I tried was a, a pencil, but I found that it left lines and I didn't really like that. And so this has kind of a wax um area that you could put on your eyebrows first and then put the powder on over that it comes with a little tweezer so you can kind of plug things and keep everything cleaned up and i really like that yeah so that's um by benefits they're browsing so it's about thirty dollars but it lasts forever because yes. you use such a teeny tiny amount exactly and then another new product um, for me that ashley introduced and i absolutely love <laughs> and that's this mascara is called they're real and the first time i put it on i was absolutely surprised at how it gave my uh lashes that extra long length yeah. and just made my eyes pop and i just i love this mascara yeah mom has been using the same maybelline mascara for a million years yes. and i was like you have to try this the size i got her is actually the travel size and she's had that for quite a while yes. now um so and it was only 10 bucks so if you want to try it that's a great way to do it get the travel size and i bought it on ebay and this is also benefits their real mascara okay perfect what's next oh okay so one thing about my mom is her hair is always on point <laughs> I'm a little jealous of how on point it is, so she's going to share some of her hair secrets with you right now. I have really straight, thin, fine hair that wants to just cling to my <laughs> head. And um, so one of the things that I'm known for is to tease my hair and make it really big. And so one of the things that I use um, after I shampoo, and let me back up and just say my shampoo as well. I also have my hair colored, and I had problems in between um, my trips to the beauty shop with my hair fading. Yeah. And so one of the things that I use um, is L'Oreal Ever Pure, and it's sulfate free. And this is one of the reasons why it helps the color stay true in between um, your colors and she uses the one that's rosemary I use it but I use it in a different scent hers is volume but as you can see I already have big hair and so I use um, a moisturizing one so the ever pure comes in a lot of different hair texture sizes but it does make your color last a lot longer and it smells incredible and then I also use their leave-in conditioner. Um, mm -hmm. Because my hair is so fine, I found that when I used a conditioner that I would put in and then rinse out, it would make my hair just be really oily. And so I use this, and, it, and I love it. It doesn't give me that problem. Um, that, we actually, they've discontinued making, and so we bought a ton of it online, but they do make it for curly hair. So if you have the greasy problem with conditioners, um, definitely recommend their um, their leave-ins, um, but it's only for curly hair, and mom has like a little stockpile under the sink of that stuff. So if you can find it, I would highly recommend it. I use it as well, and it um, makes the hair, um, it's not really crunchy, but it does kind of give a little more stiffening effect, so if you are going to tease it and stuff, it's really great for that. And another thing that I do, um, because I don't necessarily con condition it every day, and that is I use a root pump and I use the big sexy hair. Um, <laughs> so I'll shampoo my hair while it's still wet. I'll just lightly um, put the pump in at the top, uh, dry it with my rounded brush, and then um, 
I'll do my famous tease to kind of give me a little bit I more height. I genuinely wish I could show you when she teases her hair. Like she just like it's never red, which first of all I'm jealous about. But I mean it is huge, and she just like combs it out and it looks nice like this. So um, maybe one day I'll get her to do this. But every time she does it, she's like, "You better not take a picture, and I better not see this on the internet because it is it's extraordinary." But her hair looks good, and this um the hairspray that she uses like. The, the, she uses this big sexy stuff and your hair will not move anywhere like I came home once before and sprayed my hair and then went out I'm not exaggerating that there was like a tornado like winds that strong my hair stayed in place like it's perfect so this is the big sexy hair is what's it the spray spray and play harder if you don't want your hair to move, this is the stuff. And there is one that's even more stiff than this. It's like rock <laughs> solid or something like that. And it really won't move if you do that. And then the other thing, sometimes, especially in the winter, um, when I tease my hair, it does make it a little bit fly away. You mm -hmm. know, the static thing that we have trouble with sometimes. And so I found that if I would use static guard, just a slight spritz on my hairbrush, um, then I didn't have that problem. So um, this is great, great um, for your clothes as well as your hairbrush. That's good because I don't know about you, but in the winter, my hair, like the flyaways are crazy. So it'd be able, that's a great tip to be able to put it in your brush. Um, You can even get like travel sizes. So during the course of the day, if you need to do that, you can just do a little spritz and brush it through and help with that. Well, thank you so much for having my mom. And if you like the video, please like it. Um, Also, um, at the end, they're going to talk about some ways that you can subscribe to videos if you're liking these. Um, I have my own YouTube channel and you can definitely watch there. So I hope you guys have a wonderful Mother's Day and I hope you hug a mom. I'll hug mine. Um, And have a great day. Till next week. Bye guys. Thanks. Bye.